The countdown to the eclipse is on. Many of us humans will swap our sunglasses for eclipse glasses come April 8th. But what about our furry friends? That's a good question. Yeah. TV's Carla Rogner talked to experts about how animals can react to the sudden darkness both in the wild and at home. The Columbus Zoo will be in the path of totality when the solar eclipse crosses over Ohio. And zookeepers have one question. What are the animals going to do? On April 8th, there will be a little under two minutes to find the answer. Want to see uh, if a lot of these animals that really live on daylight, will they think it's dark and will they go into nesting or will they go, go to sleep or will they st be stressed out? We don't know. But the preparation has already begun. Zoo staff and Ohio State researchers have been studying behavior of certain animals like the red panda, bears and manatees to see if the different animals react when their habitats suddenly go dark. There's kind of this predator versus prey idea where prey we tend to think of being more skittish and jumpy because things are literally out to eat them so they're more jumpy around new stimuli and that might mean that a new stimuli like an eclipse would make them react stronger but it might not but predators are also very visually um, have very strong visual cues that, because they have to find prey so they're also very reliant on their eyes and a visual stimulus like a darkness during the day might cause them to react strongly as well one thing is for certain zoo animals won't need eclipse glasses and neither will your furry friends at home <laughs> Right, they might gaze up at the sky in general, but we don't see them staring at the sun the, the way we humans do. Dr. Lilly says pets can stay on their usual routines, but their behavior might change too if they're easily excited. It's a little bit like the 4th of July or during cookouts at Labor Day where everybody's outside, everybody's doing things. There's just lots of extra activity. And if that's something that your, your pet is concerned about, then it's going to be concerning during that time as well. Whether they're at the zoo or in your backyard, the eclipse could cause some confusion and make animals want to get ready for bed. But if you want to nap, you get to nap. Like, let's let them nap. They don't need to be awake to see it. In Powell, Carla Rogner, 10 TV News. Now, the zoo will continue to study the animals for two weeks after the eclipse, so it could be a bit longer until we find out the results of this study. For more information on the eclipse, including best viewing areas and city celebrations, you can text the word eclipse to the number on your screen right now, 614-460-3345, and you'll get a link sent straight to your phone. Well, we